Hello, I am Raymond Jackson and I am a life coach. Now a lot of people always ask me, Mr. Jackson, what qualifies you to be a life coach? And to most of them I tell them, that ain't none of your business. But for the other people, I let them know a little bit about my background. See, I coached middle school girls basketball for 22 years. Now, unfortunately it came to an abrupt end and due to a restraining order, I can no longer come within 50 feet of the school. However, now that that time has passed, I coach life. I now give advice and guidance to young people all over the world to help them in their daily functions. Today's life coach topic is cuticle etiquette. Tip number one. Just because I am in my cuticle having a nice, lovely, and bubbly conversation with one of my coworkers does not mean you have to stroll by and stop and get into the conversation. Let me diagram that for you. Here's me and my coworkers having a lively and bubbly conversation. Here you are, strolling by and trying to get in the conversation. Let me explain something to you. We playing man to man right here, not zone. What you need to do is keep it moving and go sit your butt down somewhere. Tip number two. When you come into my cuticle to have a conversation, leave some space in between us. Don't come all up close in my face trying to talk to me. Look, let me show you. Here I am. Here you go. All up in my face. See, I play a half court defense, which means keep your butt on your half. You see, close talking is for after dinner and a drink. Otherwise, go and sit your butt down somewhere. Tip number three. If you happen to notice me and another coworker talking real quiet, like whispering, don't come up and ask us what we talking about. Cause we're probably talking about you, fool. Just go on and sit your butt down somewhere. I'm Raymond Jackson, and this has been Life Coach Lessons with Raymond Jackson.